guys. Today I'm doing something a little different. VGC season is coming up actually next month, so I wanted to try and get a little bit of practice in. The team I have right now isn't complete because, um, you know, uh, Pokebank isn't accessible yet, so I have to use what I, you know, what I have. And uh, not what I have, but what I can get, I should say. Uh, and my team's kind of weird. I have two Mega Pokemon on it. I have Mega Garchomp and Mega Charizard Y. Uh, the reason for that being is that if I use Tyranitar and Garchomp together, which uh, I, I will do every time because of the fact that um, Mega Garchomp gains Sand Force when it Mega Evolves, I don't want to use Charizard on, in, in combination with those two Pokemon. Even though if a long battle does occur, uh, <laughs> I said occur, occur, I could use Charizard as a backup, but then it won't have an item, so... Um, I'm not sure. I, I, my plan right now is not to use Charizard when I use Garchomp and vice versa. But other than that, I have Zapdos, Scizor, and Shofu. That's me. Ten Commandments. Cinder block your ass. Um, but anyways, yeah, I got the Zapdos. My Zapdos doesn't have Tailwind because Tailwind is a tutor move from Black and White. Uh, my Scizor doesn't have Bug Bite. It doesn't have uh, Superpower. So I'm missing a lot of moves here. But um, my, my Tyranitar doesn't have Superpower. Um, it's, it should be okay though. Or Low Kick. Low kick. I couldn't even get low kick. I have to use like brick break and stuff. Uh, but like I said, uh, it actually turns out that the um, that the ranked battling system on Pokemon X and Y is down at the moment. But I did get a couple of good battles from the uh, random battle, double battle thing. A lot, everybody's in VGC mode on there apparently. I did get one really, really bad battle though. So hopefully I don't get any of those during this live session. So let's go ahead and hop right into it. We're going to hit up that battle spot though. Hit up that random matchup, that free battle. And uh, hopefully, like I said, we get somebody decent. Hit up that double battle. There's my T. Oh, my lord. I don't know why. I'm sorry for that loud noise just now. <laughs> Xplit's messing up. Anyways, challenge. Change the music real quick. Hit him with that Kanto. Wait, which one's Kanto? I don't know which one it is. Never mind. <laughs> but here's my team once again. Um, hopefully, this goes well. The other battles didn't really go that well. Um, I won the first one pretty convincingly. Then the second one was just a disaster. Let the sun shine in. We got my man Rio B Bakura from New York City. And he has a sun team. This is what I like to see. Because now I can bring my Tyranitar and crush some souls. <laughs> Alright, so he's clearly going to use that Charizard. Um, I could, I could use my own Charizard against him. I might do that, but let me think about this for a second. I'm thinking about leading with Zapdos, definitely. Conk Elder. Ooh. Ooh, very nice. If he does lead... Oh, I got my team already. I got my team. So this is what I'm going to do. If he does lead off with that uh, Ninetales there, and that Volcarona or whatever he wants to do, I can just switch from my Zapdos into my Tyranitar, get rid of the sun, uh, hopefully live a heat wave from whatever he goes uh, with it for, and um, and uh, kill something with a rock slide. That's that's my mindset right now. So we're gonna go ahead and confirm this. We're gonna switch back to the top screen, and we're gonna see what happens. But my, my man right here has some strength on his team. I wasn't expecting that. I'm really glad, actually. I wasn't expecting any power like this. And this is live, baby. This is all live. Let's get let's get it. Let's let's, let's just get it right now. Let's get it. Let me turn let me turn the music up a little bit. There we go. So he leads off with his Charizard and his Mammal Swan. Huh. So what I'm gonna do, he's definitely gonna go for the Heat Wave with his Charizard. I'm pretty sure that's a Charizard Y too. Now what I what what I'm messing up on here is I'm not sure if the evolution happens after the switch or not. I think it does. So what I might do is. Let me protect with both of my Pokemon. I can actually, uh, I can benefit from this as well because I have um, a flame orb on my uh, guts. I think this thing has guts, let me check. <laughs> I think it has guts. Okay, it does have guts. I have I've, a uh, flame orb on this thing, so if I use protect right now, I'll get an attack boost for next turn. Let me just use protect on both of my Pokemon just in case he does want to Mega Evolve right now. And he does want to Mega Evolve right now. So what I'm gonna do is what I said last time. I'm going to allow him to Mega Evolve, get up the drought, do whatever he wants, and then I'm going to switch to my Tyranitar next turn, get rid of the sand, uh, hopefully take out something, either, you know, whether it be his Mammoth Swine or his uh, Charizard here. 
because I'm going to go for the Rock Slide with my Conk Elder next turn. Or I could go for the uh, Drain Punch on his Mammoth Swan next turn. So I have options here. He went for the Ice Shard. Very nice. And he went for the Air Slash. Okay. So this is not going to work. I have to switch out. Because if he's going to go for the Air Slash on my Conk Elder, it's going to die immediately. Um, hmm. You know what? I could do this. Maybe I... W you know what? I know exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to paralyze this Charizard. And I'm going to switch my Tyranitar in ex instead of my... Uh, instead of switching Tyranitar in for Zapdos, I'm going to switch it in for Tyranitar. S I mean, uh, whoa, whoa, that, that sounded... That made no sense. Instead of switching my Tyranitar in for Zapdos, I'm going to switch it in for Conk Elder. There we go. My bad. I'm flustered right now. So I got rid of the... Uh, I should easily... I should easily live this Ice Shard. Uh, okay. Maybe not. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I lived with one HP. That thing is probably choice banded. Um, so he went for the air slash on my Tyranitar. Very nice. I, I'm really glad. I'm really glad I lived that ice shard because now I'm gonna be able to thunder wave the uh, the Charizard here, which is good, obviously. So that's that's great. That's really good. So what I'm gonna do now is protect with my. Uh, you know what? I'll just protect. It's fine. Hopefully I don't miss the rock slide. That's all I can that's all I can hope for right now. And hopefully that Mamoswan is banded. That did so much damage. I don't think a normal a normal ice shard would do that much to me, so I'm hoping that thing is banded. So I'm just gonna go for the rock slide now and see what happens. Protect with my Zapdos here. Okay, so he is banded. He used Ice Shard again. I'm pretty sure if he wasn't banded, he would have used Earthquake there to try and get rid of my Tyranitar. That Charizard is definitely gone. And I did a clean 35-40% to the Mamoswine with the Rock Slide. Not bad at all. Oh my lord. Things are looking great right now. <laughs> so I'm going to start doing a lot more of these because I want to get into the rhythm and into, into practice for VGC. Uh, this is definitely a VGC style battle too. There's not that, ma there's not that many gimmicks here. Um, so let's see. Uh, he's most likely going to go for the Ice Shard again. I'll probably just let my uh, Zapdos die this turn. It's not really going to be doing much. So I'll go ahead and... I guess I'll just use Thunder Wave just in case. But he's most likely just going to... Uh... See, but this is bad. This is very bad because... You know what? I'm just going to Brick Break his uh, Mammoth Swine. Hopefully it dies. Maybe I should have just used Earthquake, but Earthquake wouldn't have killed it no matter what, so... Uh, my, there goes my Zapdos. Uh, I hope he doesn't use Sleep Powder or something, that will suck. Oh, Giga Drain, that's fine, I'm gonna live that easily. Hopefully I can kill the Mammoth Swine with his Brick Break. Ah, there we go, not bad at all. Okay, so, uh, the Brick Break actually didn't come back to haunt me. <laughs> I thought it would. Um... So he has two Pokemon gone. I can bring in my Garchomp now. But Garchomp's not gonna be killing this thing in one hit. No way. Oh well. You know what? It might be because of the Sand Force. I forgot I had Sand Force. Let's see what he goes out to though. Bo Corona. Ooh. <laughs> I am gonna Mega Evolve and go straight for the Earthquake. Um You know what? Maybe I should go for Rock Slide. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Decisions, decisions. Because if I go for the rock, I can guarantee that I kill something if I go for rock slide. So I'm going to do that uh, instead of going for the uh, earthquake. Whereas he might live with both of those Pokemon if I go for the earthquake. Uh, I'm going to go for protect with my Tyranitar. Just to see what happens here. Because worst case scenario, if the sand runs out, I can always just switch it back in and try to get something to go. Uh, with that. So I use Protect here. I'm pretty sure he Giga Dr Oh! Oh, he Bug Buzz the Guard Chomp. Watch me eat this up real quick. Oh my lord, I did way too much. But at the same time, he didn't use Protect on either of those Pokemon, so I'm pretty sure that's going to be game time. I did take out the Volcarona, which was pretty much the only thing I was worried about. Uh, if he didn't attack my Guard Chomp... Okay, perfect. I won. <laughs> Victory is mine! Alright, so I'm going to uh, go for the Dragon Claw on this bad boy. And it should take it out if the Rock Slide did that much. So let's go for the Dragon Claw there. 
We're gonna go for the crunch. Just in case he ends up living the Dragon Claw or something. <laughs> Even if he lives, I have my Conk Elder to use Mach Punch next turn. Okay, perfect. Victory! <laughs> that was a pretty good battle, if I do say so myself. Especially especially because I wasn't expecting, um, you know, great battles to be... great, Or, or you know, I don't, I don't know how to say this without being mean. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just trying to keep it real. Help! Alright, so we're gonna save that, actually. I don't know why. I'm gonna upload this video as it is, but... Um, doesn't hurt, I guess. And then next, we're gonna try and get one more battle. If this battle's not that great, I'll probably won't even upload it, so you guys might not even hear this part. <laughs> but we're gonna continue battling. Searching for another battle here. Uh, change the music to number nine. Number nine is actually my favorite so far. Unless they add more later on, I don't know. But we'll see. We will see. We will see. Hallelujah. Amen. Can I get a praise God? Dookie Shed. Oh, this man, this man, we got a Dookie Shed fan right here. <laughs> Not that. Hello? You can bring Zern you, you can bring Xerneas and Evelta and Mewtwo on the wife? Okay. Alright, this is getting out of hand. See, there's no rules because this isn't ranked. There's no rules at all. So this is this is the kind of stuff I was talking about. This is what I didn't want to happen in my video. Um, if this is a funny enough battle, I guess I'll keep it in, but whatever. Uh, so for this battle, I'm going to lead with Charizard and Zapdos, because he has two water Pokemon. And the, and the Evelta, so... Uh, and the Toxicroak, so I really have nothing to lose by leading with those two. Scizor and Conk Elder. So here's the team I'm choosing to bring. Those four on the bottom. Let's get it. Let's get it, let's get it. <laughs> I get it, I get it, I swear that I get it. We did it, we did it. We just did it, we did it. Alright, let's get it. Seriously. <laughs> Greninja and Blastoise, as ya boy thought. The Greninja and Blastoise combo are here. Now, I'm kind of scared of that Greninja, to be honest, because it does have the uh, Protein. And I doubt I'll be able to kill... You know what? I got it. I got it. I'm a genius. I'm going to attack the Greninja. Simple. He's probably going to go for Mat Block or some weird move. I don't know. I don't like that move. <laughs> Let's go for the Protect on Zapdos, just in case he does want to go for the uh, Ice Beam. The Protein Ice Beam. Even though his team is looking pretty in-gamey right now. His team is looking pretty in-gamey right now. So he might not even have he might not even have the protein. We'll see though. Just I'm gonna protect just to be safe. While my majestic Pokemon spread their wings and try to fly away. Oh, he does have protein. But I hit him up with that protect like I thought. Hit him up with that solar beam, bitch! <laughs> Destroy him! Oh! How did you live? How? That's impossible. <laughs> Alright, so that protein is very, very dangerous. But what I can do here is I can switch out. Yes, I have that freedom. I have the option to switch out here. I'm going to go for the uh, protect. You know, I'm not going to go for protect. I'm going to go for solar beam on his Blastoise. And I'm going to switch out my... Zap those to my scissor. If he wants to go for that ice move, I can eat that up and then hit him up with a bullet punch real quick. You feel me, though? Yeah, you feel me. Ha <laughs> ha. You feel me, too. Don't act like you don't feel. Oh. Oh. Oh, kill him. The Mega Blastoise is coming through. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a battle. <laughs> I underestimated my opponent. But none of this changes the fact that he has a Mega. <laughs> a Whoa. Oh, okay, that's a critical hit. I was gonna say, Jesus Christ. None of this changes the fact that he has a, 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 a Mewtwo and a, and a Evelta on his team. Two Pokemon which are definitely illegal. Oh! I'm stupid. Of course the Solar Beam didn't kill the Greninja. It was an Ice type. I'm dumb. Wow, if it was an Ice type, then that is a, an impressive amount of damage coming from my, my Charizard. I completely forgot that <laughs> he was an Ice type when I hit him. 
Oh no, here it is, here it is, here it is. All right, well, I'm gonna hit them up with a heat wave. <laughs> and my, uh... I guess I'll just go for the X-Scissor on the Mewtwo, even though he's probably gonna outspeed me. Yeah, that was dumb. Should've used Protect there. Definitely should've used Protect, I'm gonna die. Psych, eating it up! Oh no, I'm dead. Psych, I'm eating that up too! I'm hard body paint. Oh, that's lame. Hopefully this is a two at KO here. Good, perfect, nice. Smack you in the face, bitch. So Toxic Crook, huh? Eh? Ooh, shiny, not bad. All right, so I'm just gonna uh, air slash this thing. Nothing to worry about here, and then I'm going to bullet punch the uh, Greninja. I don't think any of his Pokemon have Protect, so I don't really have to worry about anything. I have Faint on my uh, Scizor, actually. Uh, it's pretty good sometimes. If you know somebody's going to use Protect for a fact, and you use Faint, and then you... Uh, is it Faint? I guess it is Faint. It's not the... Uh... Anyways, if you use Faint when somebody uses Protect, you ha they're completely wide open to anything you're going to do. So, uh, Master M has been defeated. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Um, I'm going to try and do another one of these tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed it because I enjoyed it. I enjoy doing live battles, <laughs> if you didn't know, and now you know. But uh, we're going to be done here. But uh, like I said, thank you guys for watching. Uh, hopefully, we can get some more of these, some more good ones, too, um, later on in the future. Let me save the game real quick. Uh, but anyways, yeah, like I said, thank you guys for watching. I am out of here. Bye now.